It's August, and we have another Keto Box, and we have... Ya yeah boy. Ya yeah boy, Anthony. And we're going to try everything in this box right, right after, after this. this. Hey, what's up, family? I'm Joe. And I'm Anthony. And this is Two Crazy Ketos. And here on Two Crazy Ketos, we do different things, like recipe videos, we do product reviews, we talk about various keto topics, and then every Monday, we sit down on the couch for Keto on the Couch. We just kind of talk about what's going on in our lives for the week. Now, you can find us on all kinds of social media platforms, like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, and we have a website, which is twocrazyketos.com. That's where you're going to find all of our different recipes. Now, we do upload at least five new videos every single week, so make sure you subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to hit that little bell button so that you are notified every time we upload a new video. I have a hair from my mustache that is just bothering me. <laughs> so it's August. We have your boy Anthony here. Yes, I'm back. And we're going to try everything that's inside of this keto box. If you don't know what a keto box is, this is a monthly subscription service. And what are you doing? You have stuff over here. Oh, okay. I'm moving it for you so I can put the box over here. So this is a monthly subscription box. And what we basically do is we go through everything that's in this box and we try it. We're going to go over the nutrition ingredients. We're going to go over how much it costs and we're going to let you know what it tastes like. And the whole purpose of Anthony being here is Anthony is not keto. And I'm honest. And you're, he's honest. So you're going to get a perspective from a non-keto person of what does this taste like? Now, if you are interested in getting a keto box, there is a link down below. And we also have a coupon code, uh, which is two crazy ketos. And that gets you some kind, I forget how much, but it gets you a discount off of your first box. I need to put my glasses on. Are you ready? I'm ready. I'm going to start with a product I've never seen before. <laughs> You've never seen this I've before. I've never seen this product before. Keto Chow. Obviously, if you've been watching our channel at all, you know, we love Keto Chow. Uh, there is a link for it down below. And if you use that link, you're going to get 10% off of every single purchase. So all you have to do is go to one of our videos, use the link that's on there, and it automatically applies a 10% off. There's no coupon code or anything like that. So they have a whole bunch of flavors, and even you like Keto Chow, so there's no sense in making this. But the main ingredients, there's a whole list of ingredients, but a lot of them are just your vitamins and your minerals and things like that. But the main ingredients, milk protein isolate, acacia gum, potassium citrate, salt, xanthan gum, uh, choline L-bitterate, uh, Chris is going to yell at me for mispronouncing that. Magnesium malate, cocoa powder, potassium chloride, natural flavors, and a vitamin blend. And there's a whole list of vitamin blend. A and lot then, of vitamins, A through A C. lot of vitamins, and then sucralose. So each one of these is going to give you a third of all of the vitamins, nutrients, and electrolytes that you need for a day. You don't have to drink three in a day. You could drink just one. You can have it as one of your meals and then regular meals for your other two meals, however you want to do it. What we love about Keto Chow is you get to decide what fat and how much fat. So if you just use this one package, it's 128 calories. Um, there's like 0.90 grams of fat, like no fat in it. There is 26.58 grams of protein, 8.27 total carbs, which is all pretty much coming from the chocolate and the acacia gum and then 1.53 grams of net carbs. If you were to add, say, a half a cup of heavy whipping cream, that would make it 535 calories, 44 grams of fat, and then uh, it would be 4.83 total uh, net carbs because, again, there's carbs inside of your heavy cream. You can also use butter, avocado oil, any kind of fats you want. We absolutely love this. A few different ways to buy it. If you buy these individual packets like this, these sample packets, it's a little more expensive, $4.75. If you buy it in a 21, mat, ba, uh, 21 meal bag, it drops down to $3.33, and that's before any discounts, coupons, yeah. anything like that. Like, that doesn't include our 10% off, and it doesn't include their flavor of the week, which they have one every single week. So with no need to try that. Do you like Keto Chow? Uh, keto Chow is good. Keto Chow is good. I drink it with milk, though. You drink it with milk. I just have normal milk. So you make it like a milkshake. I make it like a milkshake. Okay, next up. Keto-friendly confetti mug cake mix. We've actually had these before. So, let's see. Ingredients. Allulose, blanched almond flour, coconut flour, sugar-free sprinkles. Um, the sprinkles have a all. Soluble corn fiber, 
palm kernel oil, sunflower lecithin, natural colors, um, beet, cabbage, beta carotene, annatto, gum arabic, canuba wax, MCT oil, MCT oil powder, MCT oil hydro hydrolyzed collagen bovine, flax seed powder, egg white powder, natural flavors, baking powder, salt, and stevia, and leaf extract. Extract. Awesome. So nutrition. Um, serving size is one pouch, 210 calories, 16 total grams of fat, 34 grams of total carbs, 6 grams of fiber, 3 grams of sugar, and 1 gram of sugar alcohol. That seems like a lot. It is a lot of total carbs. A 4 lot. grams of net carbs. That's 4 grams of net carbs. How? Because there is, she's using allulose, and she uses a lot of allulose. But where is that listed over here? Uh, okay, so there's one gram of sugar alcohol, and then over here, she's got here. There it is. 23 okay. grams of allulose. Wow. Let's pause, because yeah. you haven't had one of these. Let's. I forgot about this one. Let's go make it. So what you're going to do is add this to a mug, two tablespoons plus one teaspoon of water, stir, microwave for 60 seconds. Okay, we're back. Now, you said there were a few different options, There were a options, few different right? options. So I made the optional mix of a tablespoon of melted butter, then pour in the mix, and then add an egg and stir it. And then I microwaved it for a minute and 15 seconds. So you wanted to give it its best chance. Yes, I'm giving it its best chance. Or you can put it in the oven for three at 350 for 25 to 30 minutes, but that takes too long. Okay, so one minute in here. Here's what we got. It's not coming out. It's not coming out. You should out. use the spoon. Well... I cut around the edge. That's, well, it, there's a bottom. It's pretty clean inside, so. So yeah. that is the mug cake right there. What flavor is this one? So if you, if you didn't know, by the way, this, is, mug cake. this used to be called Primal Noms. And uh, I actually got to meet the owner with Rachel. Her name is Allie, super nice girl. I've had better. I've had better with just water. The texture is really good. Yeah. But it is not sweet very enough. sweet, especially when you consider the amount of allulose in there. I mean, that is a lot of allulose. So price on those, they have lowered the price uh, just a little bit. $3.60. I think it's like $18 for five of them. Next up, why do you keep giving me all the yuck stuff? Or well, not yuck, but not good stuff. Because I want the good stuff. Okay, so this is Manuvo Har Harvest Dried Organic Coconut. We've actually had this before. Uh, ingredients in this, organic dried coconut. Okay? Oh, wow. So, I didn't know that was coming. One and a half servings per container. That's pretty good. Although I'd rather you just tell me it's one serving or two servings. But don't tell me it's one and a half servings. That's stupid. 220 calories, 16 grams of fat, 10 grams of total carbohydrates, 6.5 grams of dietary fiber, 2 grams of protein. So it's three and a half net carbs per serving. And I'm not the biggest fan of coconut, so I probably don't... I don't know if I'll like this. It's just dried coconut. But I don't like the... Ooh. Texture of coconut. But I do like that. Look at it. I mean, it's like nice, just shaved pieces of coconut. It's not bad. It's not a, bad. It's a good chip. Yeah. It's not bad. I mean, if you're looking for like a snacking thing, going to the movies or something like that, do we still go to the movies? Not because of COVID. They're opening back up, though. I did see a movie theater by us is starting to open back up, but only like one movie a day or something like that. Oh, I said, oh that's why I don't like coconut. <laughs> I don't like the texture. Uh, price on that is $4 a bag. No. <laughs> Next up, California Keto. You, you keep taking all of the good stuff. Well, I'm the, I control the box, so I get to pick what I what I give you. Okay, so this was a pre-mix. We've already made it. Yes. Um, so it, the ingredients are almond flour, ripped tall, pecans, medium chain triglycerides, egg white, peanut flour, cinnamon, vanilla powder, monk fruit extract. Very good ingredients. So this is a cinnamon pecan energy bite mix. All right. So there are six servings in the container and two... There, so in two of the balls are one serving. So per two bites, and as prepared, it's eight grams of fat, 
eight grams of carbs, three grams of fiber, less than one gram of total sugar, and three grams of sugar alcohol. So. Okay, this is a little confusing because, okay, so to make this, you put four tablespoons of nut butter and three tablespoons of water and mix it, and I've already made it. It says you can also use a liquid of your choice. You can use water, nut milk, heavy whipping cream, or coconut oil. I just used in used water. So, okay, so it's per two bites, but that's gonna be without the fat. There's no way adding in all of that nut butter only increased it by 10 calories and no fat. Yeah. Does that make sense? Yeah. Okay, so here's what we got. I actually made six of them. And the only kind of nut butter we had, we had some of the perfect keto nut butter, and then we had some crunchy peanut butter, but that didn't have any sugar in it. I didn't use your stuff. So I mixed two tablespoons of the crunchy peanut butter and two tablespoons of the perfect keto nut butter. That's pretty dang good. It is energy bites. Mm -hmm. It's a fat bomb, basically. I've had a fat bomb. I don't taste like a fat bomb. You're actually pretty good. I like these. This is good. Basically, all they're doing is giving you a perfect blend of like almond flour and sweet, a tall. They're good. I can't even eat that whole thing. They're a little sweet. I gotta put this down. <sighs> and the price. Okay, and the price. Nine dollars for a bag. All right, and guess what you're getting? What am I? <laughs> Keep. You think you're giving me something not good, but I actually like Kali rice. And we're not gonna open this because I'm gonna bring this on our camping trip. Uh, but this is cauliflower rice with tomatoes, garlic, and herbs. I probably should open it and make you have it, I'm but good. it's really good. Uh, I love this stuff because it's shelf stable. It doesn't have to be refrigerated or froze or anything like that. And that's why it's perfect for like a camping trip. And they mm -hmm. have a lot of different flavors. That doesn't look appealing. That doesn't look appealing. Look, look. No, where, where is this? This doesn't look appealing. It just looks like... It's the seasoning. But it look, It looks like they just shoved a wet liquid in a bag and it's now... It actually tastes very good. All right, okay, well. so serving size is the entire container, which oh, this wow. is a lot. 80 calories, 2 grams of fat, 3 grams of protein, 12 total carbohydrates, 6 grams of dietary fiber. The ingredients in this are cauliflower, 93%. Tomato powder, garlic powder, minced onion, black olives, tomato granulars, granules, black pepper, oregano, paprika, parsley, and basil. Now this one is higher carb than most of the other flavors, obviously because tomato. Tomato adds a bunch of carbs. But tomato is amazing. Yeah. So just it gives you a little comparison on the back. It says cauliflower rice, 80 calories, 12 grams of carbs. White rice, 260 calories, 57 grams of carbs. Ooh, that's an oof. Couscous, 220 calories, 46 grams of carbs. Quinoa, 240 calories, 42 grams of carbs. I don't carbs. eat quinoa, by the way. That's, that's so, weird. Really, really good stuff. This will be going on our camping trip. So we're not eating this. Oh, price on this. You can get it directly from their website, $3.29. They also sell it that's at not bad. Walmart. Oh, wow. That's not bad. So you can get it pretty much everywhere. Uh, I have noticed it's very expensive on Amazon, though. All right. Crispy cuts, Parmesan peppercorn. What are they? Just they're just pork cheese rinds. bites. Oh, pork, pork rinds. Pork rinds. Oh, pork rinds. I didn't see that. I've had this before. I remember this. Yep. So, the ingredients are fried pork skins, grated Parmesan cheese, pasteurized part skim milk, cheese culture, salt enzymes, and spices, including peppercorn, salt, dehydrated garlic. Oh wow! Um, two servings in a container. This is not two servings. It's one this serving. is serving size is half an ounce. Give me like a chip size at least. How do I? What do, I don't know what half an ounce is. <laughs> How about it's the serving size is the bag, right? It's a small bag. It's a small bag. Um, calorie eighty calories in, in. Oh, so for a serving, six grams of fat, one gram of carb, no fiber, no sugars, seven protein. Yep, seven protein. All right. Nobody, not even me, is eating a half of this bag. This is a strong bag. Don't use your teeth. <laughs> it's a pork rind. I mean, it's pretty good. I'll probably take it. They're good. I'm spoiled with pork and good. Uh, price on these, $2.20 a bag. That's not bad. You're no. cheaper than a bag of chips. Yeah. 
pretty good. Next up. I'm deciding what I want to give you. <laughs> I'll give you those. Tabitha, you can't be near this one. Go away. Ice chips, yes. So these are sweetened with xylitol ice chips candy. I was looking on their website. They have a lot of flavors, like root beer float. <laughs> root beer float, strawberry daiquiri, pina colada. Uh, I really want to order some if they're any good. Okay, so. We've had these before. Ha not this one. Oh, not this one. We've had the lemon one. Uh, that was a different company. Oh. Ingredients in this are xylitol, peppermint oil, cream of tartar, and calcium stearate. Serving size is two pieces or two grams. I mean, considering it's like, I can already tell you it's different size pieces. So how are you going to measure out two pieces? Approximately 25 servings per bag. Five calories. <laughs> I see you. Uh, two total carbohydrates and zero grams of protein. Only thing about xylitol is xylitol will have a slight impact on your glucose and your insulin because it is not zero on the glycemic impact. Not to mention it'll kill your dog. It will kill your dog, so keep it away from your dogs. Now when you buy this, you can actually, it usually comes in like those little Altoids tins. Oh my gosh, I can, now I'm having an allergy attack and I smell it. Oh, man, that hits you. <laughs> I feel like I should blow in here and I should just see smoke come out, but it's not how that works. That is a straight up candy cane. Wow. That's good. That is a straight up candy cane. That's probably better if you just put it on your tongue and let it dissolve like an Altoid. Like that's better than Altoids. Those are good. I will be ordering- This is like if you go to the dentist. And like the day before you go to the dentist, or at least the day of, you brush your teeth, you gotta pop this whole thing in your mouth. It seems like you be brushing your teeth every single day. <laughs> we know you ain't doing it every day. You forget sometimes. Price on these, $15 for three cans on Amazon. And you can go to their website, and I think it's $30 for six of choose your own flavors kind of thing. So you, it's same price, Amazon or their website. And it is Amazon Prime. So if you know the flavor you want, go to Amazon. All right. Macadamias, macadamia nuts. Um, what is it, a flavor? Oh, roasted with Nambian sea salt. Okay. All right, the ingredients are, it's really There small. should be two ingredients. Macadamia nuts and sea salt. Okay. There we go. We're off to a good start. Um, servings per container, one pack, good job on them. 280 calories, 29 grams of fat, six grams of total carbs, three grams of fiber, and two grams of sugar. That's natural sugar. Yeah. Three grams of protein. Yes. So okay. and then so that means this, this whole thing is only three net carbs. Yep. Now macadamia nuts are actually Don't really good for you on keto. High fat, good fats, uh, but they're very expensive, like nineteen twenty dollars per pound. This is the best nut. And I have no control over them. So honestly, I like this because I'm this. I like now we're gonna give this to mom. What? <laughs> Um, I like the fact that it's an individual bag, so I won't overdo it if I just have the bag and I know I'm done. I've already eaten like six of them. That is good. That is really good. Like usually we would go to Costco and get the big bag and we finish that bag in a day. $30 for 12 bags, $2.50 a bag. But again, remember macadamia nuts I know are, they are like $20 a pound. I know they are. Super expensive, but really, really good. No palm oil, nothing artificial. That's a good nut. That is good. Here you go. You're having fun with this, aren't mm -hmm. you? I saved the best one for last. Okay. The cookie department. We've had this before. Uh, is this the same one that we got at, or not same flavor? Is this the same company no. that we got at Big Lots? No. no, it's a different company. Okay. You can have your cake and eat it too. It's your party and you can eat cookies if you want to because the cookie department's cake walk has only one gram of sugar and three net carbs. Ingredients, almond flour monk fruit sweetener, which is erythritol and monk fruit extract, grass-fed unsalted butter. Why would you ever use unsalted butter? Whole eggs, prebiotic fiber, which is tapioca syrup. Eww, I'm starting to think that's IMO. Heavy cream powder, which is cream. Contains less than 2% of rosemary, 
extract, sprinkles, arabic gum, spirulina extract, red cabbage extract, turmeric extract, radish extract. That's all for their uh, uh, sprinkles. That's what that is. Baking soda, xanthan gum, natural flavorings, and salt. I never heard of a sprinkle that had a rosemary extract. It's like a keto type of thing. So it's for coloring and stuff. Okay, so the ingredients in this are actually okay. I, I get concerned about that tapioca syrup, which is probably IMO fiber. Serving is one cookie, 230 calories, 19 grams of fat, 17 total carbohydrates. It's definitely IMO. Uh, nine grams of sugar alcohols, six grams of protein. So nine, five, 14. So they're saying it's three net carbs per cookie. Three net carbs per cookie. Have we had this one before? I have not had this. I feel like I'm ready to like not like it already. I feel like I've had this. Hold on, hold on. Can we discuss how... It's, it's falling why apart. It's falling apart like a Nature Valley granola bar. That doesn't look appealing, I'll be honest with you. There you go. Why is it blue? That's their sprinkles. It smells weird. That's not for me. That's not for the me. taste is like okay, but not great. It's... Wow. It tastes like... Boy, does that have a cooling effect. Huh? That has a big cooling effect. What are you doing? Spitting it out? Uh, That's nasty. Give me some of these, Mac. I need that taste out of my mouth. Are you serious? There's... Boy, you're gonna eat that whole bag on mom, aren't you? You don't wanna do this. Okay. That's mine. Okay. You didn't do the price. Oh, the price. The price on those cookies? Oh, wow. $30 for eight cookies. Uh, $3.75 a cookie. What? Three dollars and seventy-five cents a cookie. No. 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 Save your money. Oh, this, this is mine. <laughs> and as always, a beef stick, because that's what I like. Um, Country Archer serving size is one stick, hundred grams, or not hundred grams, hundred calories, <laughs> seven grams of fat. Um, where is it? One. Total, one total carb and no fiber, no sugars. Where is grass-fed beef, water, sea salt, encapsulated lactic acid, cultured celery powder, which has celery powder and sea salt, garlic powder, red pepper, black pepper, cherry powder, coriander, onion powder, white pepper, ground nutmeg, parsley, colored beef collagen casing, which has paprika and beta carotene. I love Country Archer because... Country Archer has the best... Jerky, I don't, don't at me. I don't even think so. I can't go there, but I do like the fact they have no sugar. They're not using any sugar to cure their meat sticks. Oh, I'm sorry. Do you want a piece? <laughs> I just want a piece. You can have the rest. Oh, yeah. This is good. This is good. This is not a question. Yeah, they have a good flavor. Um, $1.65 per meat stick. Come and on. A Slim Jim is like $2. <laughs> Get out of here. Well, that is going to be our video for today. If you like seeing different types of videos like that, check out our playlist, which you're going to find right down there. Also, make sure you take a look at our most recent video, which you're going to find right over here. Whether or not you hit that video or you hit that video, make sure you hit this little button right down here and subscribe to our channel and also hit the bell button so that you're notified every time we upload a new video and your boy Anthony comes and eats some keto food. Especially beef sticks. Until next time. Bye. bye.